Greetings. Eileen Gottlieb, the heart healer here to share a little bit of wisdom. Did you know that this is PTSD Awareness Month, this month of June? I didn't either until I was looking at the national calendar and it spoke to me to share with you a little bit of what I understand about trauma and to offer you a tool that you might consider if you're currently experiencing trauma that is limiting you in some way. So I know that I experienced childhood trauma and you might not know that about me. And I did not realize how much it affected me until much later in life. And what happens with PTSD or post-traumatic stress disorder is that it goes on and on sometimes and you can be okay for quite a while and then all of a sudden you will see, sense, smell or experience something that triggers those symptoms all over again. And that happened to me a few years ago. I've done a lot of extensive healing work on myself to address this issue since 1994 when I had my spiritual awakening. And my connection to God was very clear to me at that time. But what happens is sometimes all the tools that we have are not getting to the root cause. And that's what I experienced. So a few years ago when my PTSD was triggered by an experience that I had, I was really looking for a tool that would finally and completely release this from me so that I could be at peace so that I wouldn't be triggered anymore. So if you've been experiencing trauma, believe me, I can fully relate. And I also found that when I started my private practice a little over 25 years ago, that the majority of clients that I attracted, and I didn't really understand why at the time, were experiencing the symptoms related to trauma of some degree or another. And what I've come to understand since then and have a great deal of experience with is that we all experience trauma at some time or another in our lives. A colleague once said, trauma is just the experience of something that doesn't feel good. Can you relate? I think that includes all of us. But when we have trauma that we haven't cleared, then we may be feeling things like, nightmares. We might be having sleep disturbances. We may be very sensitive to certain smells or people touching us, or we're triggered by different things like smells or sounds or touch. I know for me, if anyone came up behind me and touched me and I did not realize that they were behind me, I wanted to just jump out of my skin. And my family teased me about this, and it was shaming until I stood up and explained, this is not funny. This is me suffering. This is me experiencing fear. Please stop. And they finally did because they finally understood that this wasn't just me being touchy or sensitive. It was me experiencing a trigger that was bringing up fear for me. And a few years ago, when I experienced a trigger again, a few months later, the answer for me was brought, the tool that would work for me and what has worked for so many of my clients since then. And that is Ho'oponopono, the ancient Hawaiian process of atonement, forgiveness, transmutation, more commonly known as the prayer, I love you, I'm sorry, please forgive me, thank you. I bless my teacher, E. Haleakala Hulen, for all that he shared, and Joe Vitale for being the most extraordinary marketer. <laughs> He's the marketing genius that brought this information to so many more people than perhaps he might have been able to reach on his own. And so studying Ho'oponopono after doing this practice for over 10 years, only when I was guided within the context of a client session, studying it made all the difference in the world to me, which is why I began to teach it. Because the more people 
I believe, that do this work, that offer this initiation of clearing of whatever it is that we identify as an issue, challenge, or problem, the more the root cause energetically is cleared from them, from me, it's cleared from everyone that holds the same pattern of energy. So I consider Ho'oponopono to be a PSA, not a public service ad, but a public service act. And we all need help. We as a species of human beings are suffering. And our relationships are showing it. And the more that we can be comfortable in our skin, because we've released more and more of the root causes of our traumas, the more we'll be able to connect with people heart to heart, the more we have the opportunity to create peace, not only within ourselves, but peace on this divine planet that we all share. So if you've been experiencing trauma of any kind, and you've been really struggling with it, and you would value having a tool that's simple and easy to use, then join me this Saturday, June 19, for a masterclass I'm offering called Healing Trauma with Ho'oponopono. Look at the link below. It's all there for you. Or you can hop on my website at Eileen, I-L-E-N-E, thehearthealer.com. And there's a link for healing trauma. All the information you need to join me this Saturday for this masterclass is there. And if you have any questions, you can reach out to me through my website as well. I wish you joy. I wish you peace. And may you know that you are loved always. Blessings. I am Eileen, the heart healer.